Decision making is a process of specific, specifying the nature of a particular problem or opportunity and selecting among available opp opportunities to solve a problem or capture an opportunity. Whether we are dealing with an individual or group decision making, both start with a formation phase and end with a solution phase. The formation phase would be the process of identifying the problem or opportunity. The solution phase would be the process of selecting alternate routes and choosing the preferred solution. Now we're faced with a problem. Aaron, which is the branch manager of a small real estate company in town, is a well-respected man and plays the nice role very well, but has some issues with ethical decision-making. One day, Jessica, which is the main bookkeeper for all the branches, all the branch expenses, begins to go through Aaron's account for client business meetings and finds that Aaron, Aaron's account has been increasing by $1,000 a month. Jessica then finds that Aaron's meeting volume has not changed for the, for the months and accounts are over budgeted, which she begins to suspect that something is wrong here. Jessica talks with her friend Hannah, which is one of the lead real estate agents of the company. Hannah tells Jessica that Aaron has been using the money in the account for personal expenses as well as ex unauthorized business meetings and has been doing so for years. Hannah advises Jessica to just keep it quiet because it isn't hurting anyone and the company is doing well. Jessica and Hannah are faced with a group decision-making situation. Hannah wants to keep it, sweep it under the rug like nothing ever happened while well, Jessica knows this is wrong and needs it to be reported. Jessica and Hannah are not agreeing on a decision. They're left with another issue like groupthink. Groupthink is a way of in which the group has a majority vote, which becomes dominant, and others decide to follow it because they don't want to go against the choices of others. De Jessica decides to play the devil's advocate in the situation by blowing the whistle and reporting Aaron to higher authorities, which would be Justin, the human resources officer.